So moving on to FX3, it's similar to FX1 in that it's a, a pitch delay, but at the end of the delay trail, there is a reverb. So it kind of gives like a metallic -y feel to the end of the trail, which is fantastic. I'll just pop a kind of a dub record on really, a kind of a dubby thing. And I find it really works so well. So you can kind of, you can hear it there. And as you bring the delay back down, so it opens up that delay space on the timing here. So that's three over four, so it's kind of working with that rhythm. So, because it's pitched. And now what I'll do is I'll just drop that out so you can hear. You hear the noise on the end. And again, you can pitch it up. What I kind of like doing on things like this is, on the end of a, a phrase, so I kind of phase it there, and then drop it. And you can hear the noise coming out. So loads of fun. I have lots of fun with it. And yeah, that's effects three.